Judas Priest finally did it. The greatest heavy metal band of all times will finally be inducted into Rock and Roll Hall of Fame class of 2022. I'm here to announce our 2022 Rock and Roll Hall of Fame inductees. We're honored to induct the following in these special categories. Judas Priest. So yeah, on a third time being nominated, Judas Priest finally made it into Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Interestingly enough, they made it despite falling short of making it into the short list of a fan ballot. Yet still, that fact makes them one of the few metal bands which are in Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, the other ones being Black Sabbath, Metallica, and Deep Purple. Okay, I know Deep Purple isn't technically heavy metal, but it is still one of the greatest bands to ever walk the earth, and therefore I simply wanted to include them in this amazing list. <laughs> It is also worth pointing out that Judas Priest actually will not be inducted into Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in a performer category, but rather will be awarded a Special Musical Excellence Award. And in case you wonder what the flip that is, the award for musical excellence actually is given to artists, musicians, songwriters, producers, whoever it is, who specifically had a tremendous influence and dramatic impact on music overall. Um, well, yeah, I guess a lot of it, something to do with us. The other two musicians whom you may know who were also given that award are Ringo Starr and Randy Rhodes. I know that many fans believe that we as metalheads should simply forget about Rock and Roll Hall of Fame because that institution has proven itself at the very least questionable. Yes, that's true. Yet in my personal opinion, there are still at least three main reasons why a metalhead should be excited about this year's nomination. Number one, for many, many years, we all have been criticizing Rock and Roll Hall of Fame for a lack of heavy metal, one of the most influential genres and subgenres of rock and roll in its holes. Well, guess what? This year, they're finally doing exactly the opposite of what we have been criticizing them for, including a heavy metal bat. Yet of course still among this year's inductees are such artists as Eminem whose relation to rock and roll is very questionable in my personal understanding of what rock and roll actually is about. What? And at the same time they are not only inducted Judas Priest in their holes but also recognizing the achievement and influence on music overall Judas Priest had as one of the co-founders of heavy metal as a genre. Number two is very simple. The guys were simply very excited about it and Rob Halford when commenting on the matter said that he finally will be able to take a picture with his favorite Dolly Parton. Number three the most important one, which still remains the greatest question and mystery. If we simply take a look at who are the inductees this year, meaning which Judas Priest members Rock and Roll Hall of Fame will be inducted in a class of 2022, we will of course see Rob Halford, Ian Hill, Glenn Tipton, Scott Travis, but also Les Binks and KK Downing. And this is why I personally, and I know many other metalheads, are so excited about Judas Priest finally making it into Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, because now we can speculate whether we will finally see a reunion of KK Downing and the rest of the guys from Judas Priest on stage once again. And I truly do hope that the guys from Judas Priest will invite KK Downing and Les Binks over on stage, because without them this acknowledgement would simply be incomplete. What I also hope about is that the next episode of our Judas Priest I will be recording back home, despite it being very, very beautiful here, of course. Still, I want all the Russian orcs to either die or simply get away from our country and simply let us be. But anyways, what do you guys personally think about the news? Are you personally excited about Judas Priest finally making it into Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and joining the few metal bands that are there already, such as Black Sabbath and Metallica? And who, in your opinion, should have been inducted into Rock and Roll Hall of Fame a long time ago? Please let us know in the comments. Thank you so much for watching this very spontaneous news video, and we will prevail. Slava Ukraine!